Hello my gorgeous moonbeam and how are you today? And may I add, your hair is looking particularly shiny today. Did you do something different in your routine? Now this has been at the back of my mind for quite some time. It has been brought to my attention that the vast majority of my viewers are male. So instead of catering to my actual audience, I decided to try and bring in more female viewership instead. So that's why today's episode is dedicated entirely to women worldwide. So please ladies, bring me that sweet sweet YouTube revenue, you know, in the name of equality. And men, I kindly urge you to click on to the next video, not because I wouldn't want you here, but rather because watching ASMR for women is the gateway to bigger problems. Next thing you know, you'll be drinking Chardonnay on a weeknight and unironically tweeting about the current season of The Bachelor. So, view at your own discretion. Well, now that the boys are gone, it is just you and me, Shining Star. So, how about the makeover? So, the first step is cleansing your skin. And I'm not implying that your face is dirty, or that you would particularly need this. But it's best if we start our makeover with a blank canvas. And after all, I think the process of washing your face can be quite relaxing at times. And whether you're watching this at night, trying to get your beauty sleep or while you are studying, you know, trying to get that academic bread, I think you'll be in good hands. So, I have here the smoothest, gentlest face wash that my cheap ass could afford. And I am going to be applying this all over your face, get it to foam a little bit, and then I have a surprise for you. So. I think about this much would be enough. for me, please.
a little surprise for you I have here this little gadget that will help me better clean your skin it has this tiny tiny silicone bristles that are supposed to get in every nook and cranny and pore and just get rid of all the impurities and the best part it matches my nails so well so I'm just going to switch this on How do you feel? Oh, you can't feel your face anymore? Well, that means it's working So I brought you a little snack I figured you should perhaps eat it before we begin with your makeup so that your lipstick won't smear I brought you your favorite yogurt I know, I'm sort of psychic like that, and I mean... Just kidding, I mean, what kind of woman in the right mind doesn't eat Activia? I mean, come on, we've all seen the commercials So, here's yours and I also have one for myself This is nice, right? I mean, we never get to you sit like this and talk anymore Oh, tell me all about yourself What are your passions? What's your favorite show? No, no, let me guess It's HBO's Girls See, I told you I was sort of psychic But, I mean, come on Lena Dunham, an icon and so brave Speaking of brave, you know who else? Amy Schumer, yes, Amy Schumer I mean, I hope that one day I will have a daughter be as funny and as brave as her And speaking of brave, I mean, Taylor Swift, come on when you have to think about all the hardships she had to go through it's just it's just too much you know 
every morning I wake up and I pray to God to make me as pretty and as brave as her Oh, and don't get me started on JK Rowling I mean, after she tweeted that Mrs. Norris Filch's cat was actually a feminist queer woman of color it just entirely changed my perspective on the Harry Potter universe I mean, how woke must you be to put something like that out there 12 years after the book series has ended and it has no impact whatsoever on the sales it was just mind-blowing yeah, I know there they're all such role models Sometimes I cannot believe I am so fortunate to share the same timeline as them Oh, are you done with that? Good, give it to me and we can begin your makeup So, I will be using the original naked palette to do your makeup yes I know it's like seeing an antique right here I managed to get my hands on one of the last remaining ones after Urban Decay discontinued it you know before they announced that they are going to piss on its corpse and then set it ablaze I'm just going to pick some of the sparkliest colors in this palette to do your makeup So, close your eyes to fall asleep during this process that's okay also it just means that when you wake up you look yourself in the mirror and see your best self so in order to aid with your relaxation I am just going to read you some of Chrissy Teigen's best tweets while I do your makeup OJ American Crime is over but Real Housewives of New York begins tonight when one door closes, another one opens and Adderall falls out A Google search saying Can you get tear gassed if you are already crying? And Chrissy Teigen replied Prepping for tonight I always come home to 50 wedding invitations from strangers You guys are kind of crazy But I'll have the chicken, I guess Six hot dogs before projectile vomiting last year Let's see how much I've grown my point, my point here is, I'm drinking Why is everything a bar now? Eyebrow bar, denim bar, blow dry bar The word bar used to be so special and reserved for alcohol times 
does Alicia Vikander have a Twitter? Because I would definitely give her a back rub tomorrow. What if... What if the fatty shit was healthy and the healthy shit was fatty? Makes you think. It really does, Chrissy. It really does. Japanese anime porn documentary on the HBO. It's not creepy to watch because of the word documentary. The 30 seconds of cold skin and hair post shower. Not worth it to me anymore. I no longer wish to shower again. Remember when that Whole Foods photo was going around, everyone was like, who the fuck would buy a peeled orange? Well, the answer is me. Well, it looks like we are all done. Feel free to look yourself in the mirror now. There is something that I really need to get your opinion on. It's quite a delicate subject, but I figure since we're both women, there's nothing to be embarrassed of, really. I am talking about periods. I mean, sure, I can see their use, and it's quite annoying when you don't get one for a long time. But at the same time, I think they're my least favorite form of punctuation. Yeah, I mean, everybody who has eyes can see that a semicolon is way prettier. Don't you agree with me? Okay, so I think it's safe to say that there's no man watching this anymore. So, in that case, I think it's about time we put our plan to action. Okay, so recap, we strike at midnight, take no prisoners, only keep the men who know how to cook and know our best angles for Instagram photos. Okay, sounds good. Let's make Temiscara great again. <laughs>